everyone welcome back to my channel it's Trish so today I will be doing my first ever holiday collab video with one of my friends here on YouTube her name is Whitney um, she did more of a softer look and I did more of a smoky look this is what I came up with I would include her look in the video um, she does really good makeup she has bomb makeup skills um, I also went to high school with her, so it's really exciting that I get that I know somebody to do a collab video with. Um, check her out, subscribe to her channel. I will link all her information in the description box, her video, and her channel. If you guys like what I came up with, and if you want to see how I got this look, stay tuned in, keep watching. Everything will be listed down in the description box, and do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I will see you guys in my next one. So I'm starting off with my Morphe 12 MB palette. I'm going to take this golden shade and I'm going to use that as my brow bone color. transition shade I'll be using is this color called Creamsicle from the Jaclyn Hill palette. Second transition shade I'm using is this shade called Brick from the Morphe 3502 palette and I'm using that shade just to warm up my crease area. Shade I'm taking is the shade called Hunts from the Jaclyn Hill palette and I'm just going to be putting that right below my two transition shades that I put down. The next shade I'm taking is the shade called In The Zone from the 3502 palette and I'm just going to start working on my crease and intensifying it. Right here, I'm just taking a denser eye brush and I'm taking picking up the same shade and I'm just trying to intensify the color in my outer crease area. So now it's time to cut the crease. I'm taking my two brushes I used to cut my crease with and I'm taking the LA Girl Pro Concealer in the color Toast and I'm gonna just go ahead and start cutting out my crease. going for a warm smoky eye so I'll be taking these two colors from the 3502 palette called Chestnut and Brave and I'm just going to place that all over my lid. So I'm going to be using my NYX Matte Liquid Liner to line my lid and I, I usually always do a winged out liner. For some reason I just can't, I can't do my makeup without doing a wing liner. Some people, you know, like they do like the eye look and they'll put it on their lashes and that's cool too or whatever and you know eventually I do want to try that but for right now I'm going to stick with my wing liners. Thank you. 
So I'm taking this clear lash adhesive and this Is Me glitter that I got from the Beauty Spot store. I forgot the name of the glitter, but it's a rose gold shade and it has like specks of other color in it. It's really pretty. So I went ahead and did my other eye off camera and I also went ahead and primed my face with my Real Matte Primer and I went ahead and put on my foundation. The foundation I use is the Maybelline Fit Me Matte Foundation in the color Deep Bronze. So now I'm just taking my LA Girl Pro Concealer in the color Mahogany and I'm just contouring my cheekbones and around my forehead. Now I'm taking my Kat Von D concealer in the color D35 Neutral and I'm just gonna go ahead and highlight under my eyes, down my nose, my forehead, my cupid's bow and my chin. And I'm gonna blend it out with my beauty blender. So I'm just taking my sleek contour kit in the color deep and I'm just gonna contour again around my forehead and my cheekbones. Okay, now I'm just gonna be setting my highlighted areas with my Sasha Buttercup powder, and I'm gonna be using my Ben Nye Translucent Powder in the color Sienna, and I'm just gonna set my face with that. Now I'm just gonna take my face powder and I'm gonna bake underneath my contour. So I'm gonna go ahead and put some lip balm on my lip because you, you know we don't want no um, crusty lips when we're putting on our lip color. And I'm gonna go ahead and go back over my brows because like I always say, my brows get lost when I'm doing my face routine. So 
So I'm taking my Ruby Kisses powder in the color Ebony. Or I think it's Cognat. I'm not sure. It's either Ebony or Cognat. And I'm just going to go ahead and contour my nose. I usually take a dish brush first and I carve out my nose. And I take another brush and I blend it out. Taking my fluffy face brush and I'm dusting away that powder and I'm just going to take my spoolie and go back over my brows. Taking this color called Rocks and out of the Jaclyn Hill palette, and I'm just gonna use that shade on my lower lash line, and I'm also gonna smudge it out. And this shade called Little Lady, and I'm just gonna put that in my inner to neck area. So now I'm using my e.l.f. gel liner and I'm just going to put that in my waterline. So I'm taking my sleek blush in the color coral and I'm just going to put that on the apples of my cheek. So I'm going to be setting my face with my NYX Dewy Setting Spray and I'm taking my MAC highlighter in the color Cheeky Bronze and I'm just going to highlight my face with that. Lip liner I'm going to be using is the NYX Sway lip liner in the color Downtown. And for the lip color I'm using is the Too Faced Matte Liquid Lipstick in the color Sellout. And I'm just going to be putting this Essence lip gloss on top of that. everyone for tuning in and watching my new video i hope you guys enjoyed the look everything i use will be listed down in the description box do not forget to also go check out whitney's look and subscribe to her channel she is the bomb.com do not forget to like comment and or subscribe and i will see you guys in my next one